was working hard to manage my brain with one big nope. It takes more than time to say yep to Zyrecti. Zyrecti is an IV infusion that helps prevent migraine attacks. Chronic migraine patients. Alrighty, what is going on, everybody? My name is Bo Latour, and of course, welcome back to another episode of the DLC Showcase, or of course, the Super Fast Showcase for Lego Marvel Superheroes. Now, at the time of this recording, this is still only for pre order exclusive, which means that Antonio just can't get their hands on it quite yet, but I assume that it will become available for DLC downloads very, very soon indeed. That being said, of course, last time we took a look at this fella, the symbiote of Spider Man. Today, we will shift our attention to this fella right here, the Hawkeye, or the classic version, I should say, of Hawkeye. So, of course, we've got the uh, Avengers movie version of Hawkeye, but you also have available to you the classic version, which is really what I think would have been best to do for them, is to stick to kind of like just giving maybe different versions of characters instead of uh, doing like important characters a part of the DLC pack. Because I feel like Thanos and the Studio of Spider Man are important characters and they should really not have been uh, in DLC packs. I think they should have been in the main game. Uh, but that being said, I think something like this, a classic version of Hawkeye, indeed does fit in perfectly uh, for a DLC pack. So as you can see, he definitely looks very, very much uh, like he did in the comics. Pretty darn on sweet version there of Hawkeye. He's got a cool idle animation of him just picking up arrows and shooting them. So that's pretty cool. Uh, other than that, he's got a very uh, cool close combat attack. It's like, oh, this is so close. Wait, close up. There he goes. So he uses his bows and arrows to strike upon his enemies, as you can see. Now, as far as his shooting ability, he can uh, fire off single shots. Uh, then he can aim and fire off single shots, like so, for longer distances, etc. And then, on top of that, he also has a triple shot, which is pretty cool, like, bam, see that? Triple arrow, which is pretty awesome indeed. So you can th uh, shoot three or multiple arrows at once, which is pretty awesome stuff indeed. Uh, other than that, I would believe that he has the same abilities as Hawkeye, meaning that, for example, you know, like, when yeah, you do that, to, when there's a hole and you just put an arrow there and then climb on that, uh, it uses kind of like a platform, I would assume that he has the exact same ability as uh, the other version of Hawkeye in that sense. Uh, so other than that, yeah, pretty much uh, the exact same character as Hawkeye, except you get a different skin on the character, and uh, he looks fantastic. Definitely uh, a nice addition to the super pack indeed. So there you have it. That is the classic version of Hawkeye. If you guys enjoyed this video, of course, make sure to smack that like button. Check out other characters that I have already showcased, which include the following fellas right here, the symbiote version of uh, Spider-Man. We've got the Winter Soldier. Of course, we certainly showcased Hawkeye. We took a look at Rick Jones, a.k.a. A-Bomb. And we also look, uh, took a look at Thanos. Now, we've still got three more characters to go, so definitely stay tuned. I'll catch you guys next time for the Crap of the Seven Day. I'll see you later. Out of here. And of course, welcome back to another video showcasing the custom or super pack. Sorry, not custom super pack. Custom, not that special, not custom super pack again. I say super pack again. Alrighty, the super pack DLC pack single edition that is currently only a pre order exclusive. So, of course, if you have not pre ordered Lego Marvel mm -hmm. Heroes, you don't currently have a way to get these characters. But later down the line, just like they did with uh, Lego Batman 2, I would imagine that they would make these characters available for DLC. But nonetheless, of course, last time we showcased Thanos, who was pretty gosh dang appealing and enthusiastic, one of the big figures, and today we will shift our attention to the next character, and that is the Winter Soldier, right here. So of course, uh, unfortunately, he does not have the uh, cool idol animation or anything like that, so just kind of stands there. So he's pretty tough. Of course, he's going to play a big role in the brand new Captain America movie, uh, The Winter Soldier, which looks fantastic. That movie looks fan flipping tastic I mean, it looks really, really awesome. And uh, I cannot wait uh, to actually see that. And especially the trailer looks absolutely amazing. If you haven't seen it, definitely, definitely check it out. So as you can see, as far as the character itself, he looks pretty darn, darn cool. Uh, definitely has uh, a lot of the elements. 
afternoon sound we're gonna have a star on the shoulder uh do metal arm uh left metal arm uh he's got uh all of his attire to fit he's got a blaster to uh, you know take down some of his uh foes and i'm saying foes because uh some of them are good guys some of them are bad guys spoiler alert um of course he can jump uh, nothing too special there in particular uh, as far as his attacks he just uh uses the gun the blaster that i just mentioned so uh, that's pretty much his ability. He doesn't really use his punching or kicking or anything like that. He just uses the gun. In fact, even if you do an attack like, you know, a jumping attack like this, he just hits you with the gun. So that's his main weapon, main tool. Uh, you can press the circle button to put away the gun if you need to. So that's really nice. At least they give you that ability. And of course, you can also aim to do kind of like a sniper shot, like one single uh, shot instead of a rapid fire. So for example, here. You see? Boom, boom. There you have it. So that's pretty much it. That is the Winter Soldier. As you can see, a pretty darn darn cool character in this video. With that being said, uh, right here I'm going to announce how to get your chance to get one of my codes that are available uh, to me. I was able to get my hands on another uh, code for the uh, PlayStation 3. Again, remember, this is the PS3 version. So uh, if you have uh, the Xbox version, unfortunately, I can't help you guys. I don't have another code for that system. But I do have an additional code for the PS3 uh, to give away to uh, get yourself the DLC pack here. Uh, so in order to get uh, a chance to win the DLC pack, all you have to do is, uh, in the comment section below, you have to uh, type Blip Army, along with any comment that you post as far as uh, Blip Army, and then go to my Twitter page, which is uh, twitter.com uh, slash blipwinner, follow that page, and on there, please ask me, who is your favorite character to play as in the game? And that's all you have to do. That is literally all that you must do. And then I will probably announce the winner, let's see, uh, today is October 28th. So let's say October, um, well, let's put it on Halloween Day. That, that's what we should do. October 31st, you will see uh, the winner, and one of you guys will get a chance to win uh, the free pack, uh, the free secret pack of uh, downloadable characters and vehicles as well. So that being said, there you have it. That is the showcase for the Winter Soldier. Of course, smash that like button, share the video with your family and friends, and favorite the videos as well. And of course, make sure to subscribe to not miss out on all the content on the Blip Winger channel. On the smash button, to say guys, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out. See you later. Alligators, true believers, Exaggera, Boom. Alrighty, what is going on everybody? My name is Paul Lipswinger and of course, welcome back to another video showcasing the Super Pack DLC Pack for Red Dead Marvel Super Heroes. For now, of course, it is a pre-order only uh, exclusive, so basically if you pre-order the game, you got access to a code which will then uh, allow you to actually... Um, of course, download the set of characters as well as a couple of exclusive vehicles uh, and some other cool stuff as well. Uh, but of course, today we're focusing on showcasing some characters. Last time we looked at Mr. A Bomb right here, who was pretty fantastic, as you guys see. But today we're going to focus on the big baddie from, uh, or at least we thought he would be the big baddie from Avengers 2. Now we know that, of course, he's not. He's Ultron, he will be. And that is, of course, Thanos. Or I know some people say Thanos. So it depends, I guess, tomato, tomato, potato, potato, however you say it. But it's, uh, I say Thanos. I know some people say Thanos. So I just wanted to, you know, cover my bases, so to speak. But as you can see, he's got a pretty darn darn cool uh, figure. Of course, he's a big figure as well, which again means that the Super Pack has bring two ginormous figures, which is fan flipping tastic. Pretty darn darn cool indeed. As you can see, he's got his uh, famous purple face with uh, those little slits. What the? Did a flower just grow in front of me? That was pretty bizarre. I think that's uh, one of his, like, idle animations. Let's see. Let's just wait. Let's do a little bit of a shot around again, around Mr. Thanos here. Take a look at what he looks like. And then the flowers appear. And look at that, Thanos. Nope. Everything he touches turns to death. Alrighty. So, of course, let's take a look at his attack showcase. Uh, he's got the elbow drop instead of the uh, double arm smash down, you know? Uh, so he's got the... I think the swing does it like this as well. Uh, from the Fantastic Four, that is. He's got the stomp down attack that allows him to 
bring up a piece of the ground and then throw it at your enemies. Uh, of course, Punisher, oh no, sorry, I forgot. He doesn't have punches. It's Teddy Bob who does. He actually has these little blasts that come out, the little energy beams. And it kind of looks like he's almost being oxygen somewhat. Uh, I would have loved if his uh, pointer would have been a little bit more unique. You know how like Sony gets a unique looking one and uh, Spider-Man gets a unique looking one. It would have been nice to have something a little bit more cosmic looking or something like that. Uh, but that being said, uh, he runs, he doesn't fly, unfortunately, uh, which uh, would have been kind of cool, like if they gave him a hovering type maneuver or something like that, because even though he doesn't do that in the comics or anything like that, I think it would have been really cool to have a ginormous minifigure flying around, and it would have been something very, very different indeed. Uh, but yeah, that being said, there you have it. That is the video showcasing Thanos. Now, I wanted to announce on the Thanos video is that I have access, guys, to another code for the PS3 version of LEGO Marvel Super Heroes. I will be doing a giveaway, but you will have to tune in into one of these random episodes to find out which one of the videos features the giveaway itself. So definitely check them all out, as uh, they will be showcased, uh, and you will be an opportunity to win one of the codes. Alrighty, guys? Of course, if you guys enjoyed this showcase for Thanos, smash that like button. Be on the lookout for some of the other characters that I will be showcasing, such as Dark Phoenix, the Winter Soldier, Symbiote Spider-Man, which honestly kind of shocks me because they didn't put him in the game. Same goes with Thanos. I'm honestly shocked because you can't get Thanos unless you have projected your DLC packs or pre-order the game. Because he's one of the main bad guys in the Marvel Universe, especially in the cosmic Marvel Universe. So you would think he would be available, but he's not. So uh, that being said, and there you have it. Of course, smash that like button, share the videos with your family and friends, favorite the videos as well. And of course, do not forget to subscribe to channel for more content on the Brooklyn Channel. I'll catch you guys next time. Stop the chat today. I'll see you later. Alligator. Peace out, guys. That five dollar baby bag is not Tim the Torpedo. It's the bigger baby Zero. And that baby bag will not do your baby any good. <laughs> Super Pack DLC Showcase for LEGO Marvel Super Heroes. Now, of course, this is a DLC pack that is currently available only to those that pre-ordered the game, but it will be available to uh, for regular DLC purchase, just like it was, for for example, with the LEGO Batman uh, 2 DLC. So for the Today Ed, you've read the title. I don't know what we're doing here. Return to Peter Parker. That, that was pretty legit. That was pretty awesome. I never noticed you could do that. Uh, but we're going to start and kick things off with Mr. Rick Jones. A.K.A. A bomb. Now he kind of reminds me of Marty McFly in terms of just uh, his getup. Like, doesn't he kind of look like him? Like, if they had a uh, Back to the Future, which they do actually have Lego, uh, but he kind of looks like him. So as you can see, he's just a basic character, just pump shit, nothing too fancy there. But then, when he gets angry, look at that! Bam, bam! The big blue A bomb comes to play. We get another ginormous minifigure, which is fantastic. As you can see, he runs very uh, gorilla-like, kind of like the Hulk, pretty much. And, of course, just like most uh, big minifigures have kind of those similar um, attacks. So, as you can see, he's got a pretty good uh, head sculpt there, which is pretty cool. I love those little spikes going off the face. I also love how they did a, a great job of making him feel scaly, which is exactly what he should be like. He's a little bit more scaly in design than uh, Abomination, even, for example, is. So, uh, that's very, very cool, as you can see. Very cool indeed, yo. Uh, as far as his attacks go, he's got the double clamp down attack there. He's got punches, of course. Nothing too fancy there. He's got the stomp down and throw a piece of the ground at the enemy, just like a uh, majority of the other big figures uh, can do. He can jump very well, as you can see. Uh, and there you have it. That is pretty much a bomb. As you can see, he's pretty gosh darn bold from Self Love in video. And uh, he runs quick and he's ready to cause some crazy mischief to everybody, I guess. So yeah, he's pretty boss. Pretty top boss indeed. As you can see, he runs very, very quickly. As far as catchphrases, uh, I don't believe he says anything. Uh, he just kind of stands and stares at you as you can see watching. So if we don't touch the screen at all, what the? Did you guys see that? That guy that just walked next to us, his hair disappeared out of nowhere like a couple of minutes late. You can see, that's it. He, he just pretty much pants. That's all he does. Bam! Let's punch that vehicle. <laughs> That was pretty awesome. But again, it's really cool to get another big minifigure, which is fantastic. Plus, uh, another one of these kind of, you know, Hulk villains to be added is also really nice because now we've got uh, Abomination.
position. We've got the whole ten. We've got eight bombs. So we've got kind of the big three. Plus, we still need to do, uh, of course, a launch with Hulk. But we'll get to that uh, in my Lego Brick Adventures episode. But that being said, if you guys enjoyed this showcase for eight bombs, smash that like button. Be on the lookout for the other characters from the DLC pack to be showcased as well. And of course. Do not forget to check out all the other cool videos on the Brick Leader YouTube channel. And if you don't want to miss out on those, then of course, smash that subscribe button. But right, you guys have a fabulous day. Thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out. See you later. Ave. Are you ready to fast track your career in engineering? Earn your accelerated master's in one year and gain the confidence and expertise to excel in the industry. Visit go.wis. Okay, so let's see. Again, plenty of subs here, but still not quite enough to get a true believer ranking, which is really what I'm trying to work toward. All right, so flying down. That was a good climb. Perfect. Just exactly what I wanted to do. Just fly down for no reason. No coherence. Thanks. Thanks, Hulk. Thanks for throwing me off. dangerous. If you hadn't realized that before, now you know that. Yay! Okay, I got the boost up. You see? Come on! You wouldn't miss enough already for a true believer? Don't I look like a true believer? I truly believe that I should be a true believer. Shouldn't that, shouldn't that be enough to make me a true believer? Alright, I'm destroying everything back here to try to get... Oh, I see another boost up. Maybe that will get us there. Not quite. I can see we're going to need more, but still. Come on. Look at that. It's not even moving. There we go. Starting to change color now. The last stud, which is nice. It's nice to see. Come on. Please change colors. Okay. Whatever. We must proceed, don't we? Here we go. I just certainly hope we can get to believe it right now. I don't want to be all of a sudden... So far, the whole game, I've managed to keep that up, and then all of a sudden not be able to get to believe it. Going, keep going. Yep, there we go. Or actually, go out, that looks like. Because we've made our way outside of the plant, only to be greeted by a swarm of enemies. Great. Wolverine being like a tour guide, you know, with a hat and a little uh, microphone in hand. He's like, well, if you look to the left, uh, you could see the uh, lung area, which is bad for you, as you see. Well, I can't imagine, though, angry him or asking him too many questions of the guy who is like, okay, I don't know the answer. Just leave me alone. Enjoy your tour or whatever. All right, let's save. Grab some of these here. Yes. All right. So, that's it. Job done. Can I get you Wolverine? There we go. Finally. Took a while. Get up there, Wolverine. All right. We got a claw switch. stud in the corner or anything? If it's Hulk, you can't pick it up. It's, it's detected. It just... That was great. Yep, that's exactly what I was hoping for to happen. Oh, God. Careful. All right, let's get through this. See where that takes us. Oh, just across. Okay. Now, let's see. Does this thing need to be broken up? And reassembled into a bridge, I would assume? Or not. Things go. See? Yes. All right. Let's make it across, guys. Whoa. Okay. It's nice to know that uh, Hulk can hurt you. Nice to know. Okay.
Okay, come on, Loki. Do the top. Get rid of those snakes, or who knows who wins the first game of the flight with that, right? Oh, right. Here we go. But I guess it's really um, doing that, you know, kind of forces the players to think characters, diversify gameplay, and stuff like that. Right? Come on. Attack everything. That's a good strategy, right? Just attack everything. Whoa! Wow. If only I was managed to figure out how to, how to do that. Okay. Where you at, fantastic? Come on, come on, come on. I just wanted to make sure it's... Okay. That's good. That boat wasn't letting me through. I just wanted to make sure that there was nothing else here. And it doesn't look like it, so now we can proceed to the next area. Ooh. Okay, that's going to require halting. Oh, boy. Come on. What you got, boat? Stomping attack. That did nothing for you. Even though we've already got two believer rankings, you never have to do 
many studs, but honestly, if you see a blue one, it's worthwhile to just pick it up, because it's going to be worth uh, a lot in the long run. So might as well, you know, do the heavy lifting, find it, locate it, pick it up, all that stuff. All right, so there we go. I'm going to slice through that wall. And I think I'm supposed to, oh, maybe that book. I thought I was supposed to attack it. That's not the, oh, God, please tell me it didn't make its way up to the top. Yay, thanks, dude. I really appreciate that. No, I'm serious. Now? Oh, my God. I was almost ready to. Almost. Almost. But almost doesn't count. Because he made it to the top. When he starts walking normally. Come on. Get, get, get this. Are you on it? Okay, good. Move, 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 please. He started walking normally. Then he almost fell off. Which made me freak out. Alright, time to put out that fire. Yay, fire truck, three greases. Part-time everything. Part-time fire truck, part-time everything else. Alright, Bolsey. Again, you know how this works. We do the, uh, you know, putting out the fire stuff and all that stuff, and then you do the pick up heavy things part. Or move heavy things. Like that. Thanks. Alright, so we're going up the stairs. Bring him, bring him, bring him. What do we have here? Ooh, we have electrocution from the enemy. Nice. Look at that. That was awesome sauce. Ooh, if we had ice cream with us, we could freeze that stuff. Alrighty, for now, I guess it's time for Wolverine to use his claw to activate that frost witch. That was engaged. I love how it's a giant ladder, so that's a... Oh, no, it's a stairwell. I thought it was a giant ladder so that even Hulk could cross. Okay, I'm kind of wondering to try this with Hulk, but I don't know how much of a... Yeah, okay. It's not really working with Hulk. So I'm just going to stick to the... Alright, careful, careful, careful. We made it to the top. You can call me Master. But I have the only true expertise. How original. What a great original name. Save, and uh, I think we've done a good job, no? In regards to defeating him. Um, we've only got one heart left. It really can't be that hard to take the, to get him under control. Come on, it's not too easy. Maybe I'm not supposed to even be attacking Wolverine, I don't know. Okay, Hulk, take him down. There we go. Boom. Disengage. Stop. Don't fall off. Come on. You're up. Knock this down. Wake up, buddy. Oh, look at that. There's Magneto. That's what I put the toe on, buddy. All right, who's next? Mr. Fantastic is next. Scientific mind will prove more controlling. I doubt it. Oh, God. Okay. Come on. He's using the scroll as a distraction. Come on. Smash Reed. Smash him whole. Okay, Wolvie. Get your hands on Reed. There you go. Perfect. And now we gotta fight this again. Come on, stop, stop, stop. <laughs> That's awesome. He's trying to get a hold of his own head. That's pretty cool. Uh oh. Careful. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Reed, you're smart enough. Don't you get your mind under control? You control my mind? Alright, here we go. Now this is 
this. Like Magneto, Doom, Loki, all of them together. I certainly hope we got out of that one before we got thrown that way. Something from you and stuff? Make the orders, Bob. We just mail this one. Hope you're rocking. It is a very uh, interesting dynamic between Hulk, Wolverine, and Mr. Fantastic. It's kind of uh, a big, uh, I guess, spectrum of characteristics covered all at once, which is pretty cool. Uh, Ready, Phil, or Phil Fagin, which is taking quite a while here. All right, here we are. Take you okay. Wolverine will meet you there. Okay, so is this your vehicle right there? This thing? You want me to jump? Can I make you jump or not? Or am I supposed to jump on this thing? That's what I'm confused about. Okay, whatever. Let's jump. Go. Boom. Oh, snap. Boom. Connection starts with Hulk is way easier because he's ginormous. Hold on. Oh, nice and easy. Perfecto. Good stuff, Hulky. You're kicking butt, dude. As usual. Nothing strictly there, but Hulk. Hulk always kicks butt. All right, let's make a landing. Oh, you don't need a parachute or something? No? Well, then again, probably not. Okay, should I have... City. We couldn't just keep it on the hell carrier. Like, Nick, I think you're starting to abuse your power here or something. Okay, I'm sorry. I need to get onto the plane. Here we go. Hulk poop. What does that mean, I wonder? I kind of want to see how Hulk drives that thing. I mean, flies on that thing. Oh, will it be more of a case that thing flies on Hulk? Hulk just carries it and runs through the streets. Ooh, what is that? a plane, or else we're going to become a national treasure at the bottom of the east. Whoa, watch out. Is that a uh, lake? I assume that's a lake. No, it's not a lake, is it? Because I think it connects to the ocean, right? I think. I'm not sure. Let me know in the comment section below. Yeah, imagine getting stuck in a 
killed the Niners in Hulk Park. Oh my God. Let that about to kill him? That would be the most brutal action you could ever see. Come on! Destroy everything! Oh, smack his back. Yay! Alright, well, this will lead us to the plan. Hulk can't cross this. Okay, good. But you know that Hulk can't cross. Or am I just smashing 
radiation based plane. Yay, great radiation plane. Very smart. Let's just play with radiation like it's nothing. It's not like it led us to a horrible conclusion last time. We didn't even turn into a ginormous green monster or anything. All right, so let's see. What does this do? This allows for flash and all our things to move green, I would agree. Stay alive over on that side. Stay the next little while. Now, let's see. What have we got here? All right, there we go. Made it across. Whoa, okay. Why don't we all just chill out? Come on, where's the vacuum? speeds up too, doesn't it? The longer you wait, the more fried you become. Oh, God. Whoa! Okay, I almost did not survive that one. Get out of there, Zulri. Oh, wow. How did I not realize that? Death. Death. Not good. Not good. Not good. I'm trying to get past Yes. Yeah. 
Ford Motor's Purple Start. Because that's what I really wanted. Oh, God, careful. Oh, wait, let's get it down. What the heck is that? Looks like nuclear rock or something. I'm not even sure. This looks dangerous. That I am sure about. All right, smacking and bashing. So far, so good. Except for that part where we just shot it like 10 times. Yep, someone, uh, zoom. That's what we need to fire. Some zoom muscle power, I would say. Whoa! Okay, that's fantastic. Where you lose like a gazillion billion stars at once. That makes me feel great. Which is awesome. Okay, let's get up there, shall we? And it looks like there's a welcoming committee up here. How's it going, guys? Snip, snip. Let's get rocking, shall we? Come on, you guys are supposed to be attacking me, not the other way around. Isn't that how this works? Come on, get the start. Wow, that took long enough. I'm trying to see to get that blue stub back there that I see, and it's so obvious that it's there, but you can't reach it. It takes like a hundred hours to get to the there. We go. Thanks, appreciate that. All right, smash them back. Gonna be a little bit of uh, I think slicing action here. Wait, but first we're gonna take down the enemy, and then there will be slicing action. Oh right! Oh god! Whoa, dude! Why are you electrocuting me? What did I do to you, dude? There we go. Watch it. Engage. <laughs> to know, and uh, thank God I wasn't in your uh, grade 2 science class. Imagine him bringing that in. Just, yep, uh, guys, I've constructed uh, basically a nuclear power plant at home. God, what did his parents let him do? Looking to be more productive this year? Yeah. Here's how you can really get it getting stuff done. According to this. Looks like there'll be a big boss fight right now. It's Bodox! I just said that, dude. I just said your name already. Come on! Take all these teams now. Boom! Come on! Combo! 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 Mambo Jumbo! combo here to Mr. Thor, Iron Man, and the human spider, of course. Oh, God. Here we go. Now, he's going for some sort of crazy move here. You know that? A big triangle, actually. Did I just hit him with a hammer? I think I did just manage to hit him with a hammer, actually. like a year to finish a combo. There we go. Done. Let's go. Next. Tag him. You see, he's an Iron Man. All I have to do is just stand back here. Spray these dudes. And we're done with. And then just collect the studs. Collect the glorious studs. Hit him with the rocket. Down he goes again. supposed to get all those uh, studs and stuff. Blast him, blast him, blast him, Tony. Come on. Yes, he is a disappointment. Come on. Oh my god. 
goodness, are you kidding me? The whole field is covered in that part. How am I supposed to take them down there? Let's go. Will the punch do it? The good old fashioned punch. There goes Dean again. Oh, what the heck? He's still on the submarine. Wait, why are they? Are they trying to sink the ship? She just left her partner, dude. Wow, she stinks.
could be caught as fantastic or falling under some, uh, or sorry, some boulders falling onto the fantastic four as a result of a little bit of training work from Loki and Dr. Doom. So let's see where the story continues to take us. He said that. Shield, you're here. This is Fury. Shield, are you there? Fantastic. Listen, you're talking about Silver Friend. Down the earth and 
time one last thing was four, and it just doesn't work today. I gotta go on game pack. Try to smash this somehow. Nope, that's not gonna work. Okay, so, uh, I've, uh, literally been forced to, uh, to pause, guys. So I'll be right back, okay? I apologize for this. I really am sorry that I, uh, have not managed to be able to figure out what it is that we are meant to be doing here. I'm really sorry about that, but I'll see you in just a sec, guys. Down their 
Come on, get out. So what we do the one. Hundred percent walk for you. Okay, so for now, I think I'm just gonna proceed back to where we came from. Oh gosh, the whole team's already here. Okay, let's get going, guys. Sorry about that. I didn't mean to get everybody down there. I just wanted to check out what it was uh, that we saw. Now we're gonna go back into the castle. Come on, guys. Get over here, Reed. You gotta pull on this thingamajig with your web swinging arm. Come on. Get it down. Perfect. Go. Oh, God. All right. Let's go get our ride back. Bang. Where you at, dude? Take care of them all. Watch this. Watch this. This is gonna be epic. One shot. Whoa. Okay, they weren't all done. But they're going to be about to be done. Boom, boom. That is amazing. God, he's awesome. <laughs> this thing is epic. Okay, so, uh, ooh, what is that? There's something to assemble here. Is that? Oh, it's an electrical charge point, I think. One out of five that we'll need. So that's another limited collection thing we did. Let's cut through this door with our flame. Perfecto. Ooh, let's go! Holy smokes, that was a lot of stud. Jeez, that was insane. I've never seen that many studs. Oh, I guess we need the crane. Some heavier stuff. Back goes, boom. I think you're supposed to stand on that. There we go. Seismic hanging out down here. Can I come in with this? Wow, you got the right carpet set up for us. vacation resort where you will all hang out together. Dang. Man, this is epic. Here we go. Sure. I want your personal touch. And I'd really love to get my hands on you. Boom. Smashing the thing, holding the green goblin. It's going to destroy it. So you quit this. Whoa, what the heck? The Matrix just got blown up. There's smithereens. Wait, I'm saving, dude. Stop attacking me. That's Reed, dude, watch. That's Reed, dude. Oh, it looks like uh, the demon torch has been knocked out. So he's just going to chill out for uh, the next little while, I assume. Okay, I think this is going to require some assembly. So let's see what it is that we're going to assemble here, shall we? Is that a generator? I'm not even sure, to be honest. This is going to hurt you, for sure. <laughs> Come here. Come here. Man, you really talk a big game, don't you? I'm punching you, dude. Oh, he got away again. Come on. You just bring it again and again and again. And I'll keep kicking your butt. Oh, my God. Maybe not. Maybe you're going to kick my butt. You just absolutely blew me up. You blew me away, literally. Konami, please, go, 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 it's time to do, 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 do. Why that slam that attack not doing as much damage as it seemed like it was doing before? Okay, I think we're supposed to assemble something again. We will be in just a sec. Come on, attack that dude. Yes, perfect. Switch to one of the smaller characters so we can actually assemble this thing. Telekinetic powers. I think we're going to use it like this thing as like a flag spot. Oh no, we're just going to fly through. Boom! Okay, Nick, it's you and Goblin, one on one. Face to face. Come on, keep punching him. Why are you whistling? I'm punching you right now. Tough now, are we? Man, Nick is pretty powerful too. The guns he takes down the minions very, very quickly. Pretty 
frequently too, so that's nice. Uh, it definitely has shown up. <laughs> it's kind of creepy though when the thing that uses his arms is just a giant statue standing there with no arms. It's a little weird. All right, there we go. So there's our last piece. into thinking that that's what the gun did. Now, Doctor in the House is the name of the level that we just completed, and of course, please say unlock. You unlock the thing. Speaking of unlocking, I guess. Pick up Miss Fury as well. Awesome. So we've almost got the entire top row unlocked. Doombot. Fantastic. The Green Goblin. Very cool. Classic. Gotta have him there. Of course, we just hit our stuff count by another 143,000. It's insanely long.
All righty, we will mark the other members of the Fantastic Four, the other two, and that's of course the Thing and the Invisible Woman, even though the Thing just ran off in the Fantastic Four, of course. Thank you. 
use our arms to pull ourselves up. And I think we're supposed to make a ladder available for the rest of the team, right? There we go. Perfect. I'll do that. This falls right into place. Man, he was a genius. Thought of everything. Got it all nicely, neatly organized. Uh, Stu, I'm going to need your help, please. I'm kind of interested to see if uh, the thing can climb this, because that would be hilarious. Just <laughs> trying to see him, like, using his pinkies to hold on to the ladder. Okay, so let's see. What do we have here? Ooh, it's the collector beam. Am I not supposed to place it into this circle? You would think that that's what they need you to do. Okay.
can't ask him. Rid? And I know, by the way, some of you guys said, you say his name sometimes weird. I'm sorry, as I said, it's sometimes my accent, I have a hard time saying, like, Wittenberg, pronouncing it all the way out. I don't know why it's weird. All right, let's take all these keys down. So, I need Bonnie to be assembled, I think. I think that's probably going to turn off the laser. If I was a betting man, that's what I would guess it does. Yay! Fantastic! There we go. Now we can actually get through there. Oh, and it shuts down the protective thing. So it's basically just a shutdown of uh, all the protective systems. Security systems, I should say. All right, do we stop up here? I ain't giving that up. That's for sure. Just way in. Can't, I can't smash that? Whoa! Okay, thank God it's wisdom time. So, now we go this way, boom! Gotta love that. No! I went back for the stud, and it cost me! It cost me my life! Bro, it's not cool. Smashing back! I wonder if he has the same uh, attack of hope. Ooh, that's cool too. Oh, comes with a thunderclap. And it seems like the thing has like a, basically talking the ground at you. Like, here you go, have some ground cereal in your face. <laughs> Alrighty, what's going on, everybody? My name is Bo, and we're in a book. Welcome back to another episode of Lego Marvel Super Heroes. We've got some craziness going on. In the last episode, we were somewhat able to stop Loki. We weren't able to capture him and put a complete stop to him. However, we did have an awesome battle against the Destroyer armor, and we visited Asgard, so if you're interested in that, and that was pretty darn darn epic, go check out the previous episode. On top of that, of course, we also uh, were able to recover the Tesseract. However, Wolverine got a hold of it, and now he's trying to track down the Puma agent. So, we'll see what happens next in Lego Marvel Superheroes. Anticipated going to be taking over the X Men for this level. So that's going to be cool. We get Cyclops. It looks like um, Cyclops, Wolverine, and Triple Sex. Yep, there we go. Cyclops, Jean Grey, and of course, you're probably also going to get to play Wolverine. So uh, here we go. Triple Sex, guys. Sorry. Alrighty, guys. We are back at it. And of course, welcome back to. Lego Marvel Superheroes, that's pretty hilarious. Cyclops just wiped out the, uh, I guess, laser beam? No, not laser beam. They are laser beams coming out of his eyes, but I don't know what to call those, like, uh, goggles, I guess? I'm not sure, but it looks like he's got a little sponge and a window wiper for it. Uh, windshield wiper, that's what it's called. But nonetheless, of course, welcome back to Lego Marvel Superheroes, and of course, we are at the X Mansion in the Trillium Fire, so we gotta proceed quickly and get things under control. Get the side Here we go. Is that Stan Lee? I think that's Stan Lee. Stan, why are you hanging out everywhere? Okay, we've got the sprinkler thingamajig up uh, by a form of telekinesis. Oh, there we go. Open it up. Come on, water. Let's put out all this fire. Thank God. All right. So things are getting a little bit more under control. Now we've also finally got ourselves uh, superheroes of the... Oh, 
turns with a telekinetic uh, powers finally when he sees several locations where he could use it, but unfortunately he never had a chance to use it. Now we actually have the chance to do it, so that's cool. Okay, careful. Nice and easy. Nice and easy, that's right. Oh gosh, okay, this is not working out well. This needs to be lowered. Now, there we go. Yay! Double action, doors open, and we're heading to the X Mansion. Here we go. Alright. A little bit of a profile description by Maria Hill. Yes, please! Officially, Professor Cobb and Xavier think this is a higher learning of an ordinary boarding school. But the truth is, it also serves as a home and shelter for young mutants with extraordinary powers, collectively known as the X-Men. Oh yeah, and the other thing is, it's not very secretly, because everybody flipping knows that that's where the X-Men live. I mean, come on. It's like, oh yeah, it's a boarding school. Yeah, right? It's like, I don't know, what, what else is really obvious? Oh, something like, I don't know, fast food is not healthy for you? It's pretty obvious. And everybody knows it at this point. Come on, Shield logo. And let me play the game, bro. Come on. Loading for all this time. Ooh, okay. That's Justin Bieber. He's got extraordinary powers. Because he sings. Whoa, there's Governor. circle to affect certain objects. Okay. Now, in a little bit of a weird situation here, because I don't know in regards to what am I supposed to do with this thing. Only fire enemies there. Now, actually, now that I think about it, shouldn't Cyclops be able to... Now, let me check. Let's see. Since he does have a laser beam, shouldn't he be able to just fry this thing? Yes, indeed he may. Okay, fantastic. Good stuff. So, now it's your turn to shine. Step right up, Dean. Let's get this job done right. All right. There's some sort of a switch down here, which does what? Oh, okay. Actually, it's one of the exit points. Get out of here, guys. Bam. <laughs> Why is Dean posing? He's like, ah. Oh, okay, we need to cut an X-shaped. That's awesome. 
Jim Dunk? Jim! Very apropos, I guess. Considering we are the X-Man in the X-Mansion. Alrighty, am I going to escape with the label? Get out of there. <laughs> Alright, there we go. That's not going to work out. Well, let's just try it regularly. Here we go. Speed it up. Perfecto. And then smack them back. That little geek, okay? I'm reassembling all the books. Oh, my God. I didn't realize I was giving any instructions. I'm sorry about that, guys. I know that I'm trying to save that for the 100% watching, but my apologies. All right. So now we may proceed this way, following the Jugger Hunt, because that's probably our next... Uh,
Jason Briggs, the Archbishop Lab, I remember. He was pretty doggone awesome. I remember whenever I, I played that game, when I unlocked him, I was like, I was kicking everybody in front. I don't know what it was called. I think it was like X-Men Nemesis or something like that. I'm not even certain. I want to say that, but I'm not 100% certain. All right. There we go, Storm. Finish him off. Let's see what kind of attack she's got. Lightning! Just like Thor. Now, I wish you had a... Like, you could draw a little cloud and put out all these fires. You can... Oh, okay. Hover across fires to put them out. Wow. It's almost like I just said it. Okay. Hover across the fire. Come on. There we go. How nice. Fire has been put out by Thor. That when you put out a fire, you get money for it. Fantastic stuff. Again, one of those things that I wish was true in the real world. Every time you put out a fire, you get bam, trash, money, money, bills, all over the place. You can just start up a little fire, like put a piece of paper on fire, and put it in a trash can on the street, and run, put it out, bam, it's a hundred dollar bill. It's like, ooh, that's nice. It's your job to have. Okay, so let's see. Uh, what else can I destroy before we continue? Storm, put out that fire, please. Can you do that? How do I... Okay, wait. Stop. Hold. Stop. Can't I put that fire out? Okay, I guess not. So, Dean, it's your turn. You gotta do something with all these chairs. I have no clue what, but... You actually need to do something. Okay, here comes number two. I'm not sure how many of them we need to install. Or do you have to maybe three? I don't know. I guess we'll see right now. Magnetic powers. Does Storm have magnetic powers? I don't think so. Forget about that. <laughs> I love that they all just break into dance. Like, yay! Good stuff, good music. And I'm trying to hurricane. Here I am. Rock you like a hurricane. Whoa. I started dancing too hardcore. Ended up releasing a hurricane fart. Hurricane fart engaged! Alright, come on, Mr. Kingsley. Let's finish this job. Hopefully the Phoenix, of course, if you feel like, who's Kingsley? He's also the Phoenix. Probably, probably a more well-known name, I would guess, maybe? I'm not sure, actually. Maybe it is. Okay, wait, we need to first charge up. Charged, and then I don't know what's happened. Oh, it's a secret entrance, or in this case, exit, I guess. Okay, the students there. There we go. They're safe. They got away. Ooh, here we go. Guess it's time to battle, isn't it? I'm ready to rock. Thing. There we go. What do we have there? We will need telekinetic power to control that thingamajig. There we go. I think I just connected it, didn't I? Okay, does this need to be broken or something? To uh, attract certain objects using storm, I think it just said, right? that means. We need magnetic powers to interact with magnetic objects. Which, guess what? We don't know which one of us has magnetic powers, I would think. I think that just meant, like, I don't know. When I think of magnetic powers in the Marvel Universe, I obviously think of Magneto. I mean, telekinesis is not a magnetic power, is it? No, it doesn't count as one. Uh, let's see. Can I attack this thing? Bring down the curtain. Let's bring down the house. have been brought down. Now, I have a feeling like it has something to do with 
this. Now, some of this always needs to be blown up. Oh, I don't have anything to blow. Oh, okay, wait. Let's power this up first. That would be smart. There we are. All right, we've opened the game. Thank God. All right. I was worried that we need to open the connection. That's what it was. All right. I think it starts there. Let's proceed, guys. Thank you. 
to uh, no, be able to put out that fire. That's really what I'm trying to do, obviously. Come on, get up there, Iceman. There we go. Oh, my goodness gracious. Okay, there we go. Now, fire, go down. Why is that fire not going down? Don't get this. As an ice power character, to put out regular fire is using ice. Yeah, that's what I was trying to do. Oh my god, did you see that? Look at this. How cool is that? You can make a tiny little uh, ladder, and you can even control where you're going with it. That's awesome. Reminds me of the uh, Super Tramp. Okay. Uh, well, there's evidently something that I'm missing, and I'm not sure what that would be. Maybe I'm supposed to break this? I'm not sure. No, that's not it. Goodness gracious. What am I meant to do? Am I just supposed to proceed, aren't I? Or am I supposed to switch to block? I don't know. Oh, maybe I'm supposed to bring Juggernaut? Oh, never mind. Genius. Here it is. There we go. Finally, I broke that thing. Do I need to cool Juggernaut off? Could do that. Retrieve the Lego or something, something. What does that do? It really accomplished nothing. Goodness gracious. Objects into college, okay. There we go. Thank God, finally. Oh my God. It was so difficult to figure out what it is they wanted you to do. At least for me it was. Okay. I need to save this can. Come on, Stan. Oh, wait. Let's just proceed. Uh, thank God we have storms to put out those fires. Otherwise, we would be kind of in trouble. Okay. Now we need Iceman again. Mr. Iceman, uh, may you cool the heat, or sir? I need you to do a little bit of uh, breathing. Make some delicious uh, hot potatoes for us to cross on. Okay, that is pretty epic. I love how that forms. Is it really messy? And then it's like, it looks really cool and crystallized and hot and stuff. Ooh, it's red booby with us. Wolverine, that is. We could get some help uh, digging over here. Unfortunately, right now, we don't have anybody with that kind of ability. Maybe Nightcrawler has that ability. We need to call him. Like, Yo, Nightcrawler, I need you to dig something, bro. Where you at, Nightcrawler? And then he's like, guys, I'm busy. I'm being Nightcrawly. Professor Xavier has a very uh, nice statue of himself. A little egotistical, don't you think? All right, let's bring down all these plants. Or up, I guess. And, uh, come on, cycle up, melt down, dig, oh, never mind, don't melt them down, just cut through them. Uh, hmm, we, we need to, uh, move out of the way, for God's sake. Why is it that these characters can't think if they see a giant laser beam coming their way? Gee, you know what you should probably not be doing? Standing in front of it. There we are. Fantastic. We will do so, as long as you keep protecting our Tesseract. Okay, so, let's see. There we go. Oh, never mind. Can I be able to mind control that dude? Come on, save the lever, buddy. There we are. That does something. Something's happening. Is that an escape route? What is that? I'm not even sure. Okay, I'm seeing an X pointed up. I'm assuming I need to jump on it in that same order. And to round out the list, get out of here, jerk. Take down the enemy, guys. There's your escape route. Get out of there. <laughs> okay, these guys uh, really were not uh, taking their time. They just go, okay, escape route, let's get out of here. No, 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 no. <laughs> they definitely do not want to hang out here for too long. Ooh, let's do so. Oh, gosh. Yeah, it's definitely looking that way, Magneto. I have to admit, dude, as much as I don't like admitting it, it looks definitely not looking good for the X-Men team at this point. Here we go. Ooh, boom. Giant smackdown. Come on, man. Never thought I'd say that. Alright, time for a little bit of a 
assembly here. What is that? Yeah, those are buttons to use as a platform, probably. But for now, oh my god, knocked out the V-Ray. Very smart. Uh, telekinetic power, go! I have a feeling like I sent the wrong member up there. I almost feel like I should have probably sent up uh, Iceman. Maybe not, we'll see. Oh, never mind. You sent the correct member in the east. Good job, Cyclops. You did pretty boss. Alrighty, let's get this green stud. And now we will, of course, need Iceman. Where you at, bro? Iceman, it's time for you to put down some fire. Or put out some fire, I should say. Come on. <laughs> I love how you rollerblades. I just noticed that now. Ooh, look at that. I guess it's just a piece of a hero, no? Holy damn. That was a knife. Alrighty, bro, let's put out some fire. Alright, then... G, time for you to assemble a bridge for us of some kind. We should probably not be using wood, considering that the bottom of that whole thing is on fire. I'm not sure how much of a smart idea that is, necessarily. But I guess we'll see. Alrighty, let's open up these doors. And now we may proceed. What the heck? Was that Gambit? Is that a juggernaut chasing Gambit? Uh, Gambit? <laughs> I can't even talk. Gambit! You must stop my vision. Sure can do.
if someone is a genius, you certainly uh, took your time with that one. Beautiful. Are you talking about Mystique or Defender X? Oh, God, here comes the Juggernaut. Really cool double jump, that's nice. He's got a sense ability, kind of like Wolverine almost. Bam! Take down that fella. He's got claws like Wolverine as well, so I assume that he has a hidden ability also like Wolverine. Oh, okay. I should not be doing that because that will just get us really deep. Alright, throw down me, dude. What the heck was that, dude? That's not cool, Debbie. You're gonna throw down supposed to throw it back at you, I think. Something like that. Okay, I'm pressing the button! For God's sake! Oh my God. Dude, now you're attacking me. It's the wrong guy. Okay, which button do you want me to press to push that thing back at you? I think it's circle. on that big buffoon's head. And now, he gets to come in close and do a little bit of damage. Whoa. Big head of tank. Oh, wow. I'm happy for you, I think. Maybe not. Oh, God. Really? Okay, really nice, man. When someone takes down all those long-range attacks, That's cool. And those dudes as well. Thank you. Okay, I'm not sure what I'm what I'm meant to accomplish. Am I supposed to freeze this guy? I should do that. I should definitely do that. Great. I could also get blown up with that, but I'm very good at that part, I assume. Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me right now? Okay, so am I meant to get up there? Because I'm 
trying to tag this. Oh my god, it's almost like they're trying to force me to deactivate this silly computer thing. If you want me to do it, let me just do it then. If you're not gonna annoy me. And let me actually do the boss fight properly. There we go. Fantastic. Finally. Take him down. Put out all those flyers. Time for assembly again. This time we got different switches. Probably gonna require at least a few ingredients. We should be able to hack that computer there. Come on, come on, come on. Alright, nicely done. Smashing and bashing, smashing and bashing, nice and quickly. Now it's time to assemble another boombox or some sort of a distractor. Ooh, it's an alarm clock. Perfect. Now it's got its attention. Get over here, Joey Nuts. If I just freeze them enough, then they blow up. Yay! There we go. That's what I wanted to see. Alrighty, now it's time to freeze Guppy. Oh, come on. What's going on? Iceman? Iceman? Freeze him, please. There we go. Thank you very much. Now, Dean, finish your job. closer to Mr. Juggernaut and then it's gonna be him. You're about to get done, Juggernaut. Come on. There we go. You have just reached your destination. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> I almost picked him up just by the helmet. Sure. There you go. You've been put down. <laughs> I'm about to deliver the final blow. That's the only reason why I joined this whole thing, this whole ordeal. I thought he was on our side. I'm trying to get you frozen, dude. At least for the next little while, so we don't have to constrain ourselves with you. All right, Pete, take him down. Goodness gracious, how many of them there are. Look at all these dudes spawning out of everywhere. All right, Iceman, just take him down. Something cool, fancy dog. Oh, oh my god, I got it. Oh, there's that dude. 
did so, and let's get back to our main objective here. Going to shift this forward. There we are. And now we go to stairwell. Circuit. We are having fun. Aren't you having fun? Well, actually, probably, we probably are not having fun, especially at this point when we know that we're about to stop. I mean, we've got Boomerang, the Demon Force, Thor, and Captain America all here ready to kick your butt. So I'm sure that you don't feel like you're having a lot of fun at this point, I would imagine. Yeah, heck, why are there just palm trees or stuff? Okay, that's a little weird. That's a pig. What do we got here? Let's see. We've got, oh, that's a main kit. Nope, not interested in that. Sorry. I know, I know. Let's see. Nope, that flower down. Oh, that's another flower. Okay. I'm not too concerned with that. Let's do a little bit more digging here. All right. So, what do we have here? Oh, that's a proper box, isn't it? There we go. Then that's got something up there. Platform, turn it around. Okay. Gotta get Thor up there now. Power that up. Thor, my friend, do your thing. Get down there. Power up. And then power that thing up. Come on. There we go. All right. Perfect. Shield deactivated, and now our teammate can make it in the clock. Very cool. Let's 
even though it's leathery, it still kind of looks uh, appropriate for the Bible and stuff like that. So that's really cool. All right, let's see. Here's something that we could melt down over here. Or cut it out. Steam cast it. Melt that sucker down. Wow. Perfect. All right, so let's go see, shall we? Come on, Loki. No one's going to get you. There's no point in trying to run away at this point. Get out of there. Get out of there, Thor. 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 Get out of
Suffered a glitch, ladies and gentlemen. That's the first one I've ever had so far. Hmm. Interesting. All righty. So let me reset this then, and then uh, I'll see you in just a split second. All righty, guys. We'll see you soon. All righty, guys. So I have got it all reset, and we are ready to rumble again, shall we? All righty. So here we go. Hopefully this time we'll be a little bit more of a successful approach. Let's hope for that at least. All righty. Don't want any glitches this time around. I definitely want to avoid that. All righty, let's get rid of these things here. All right, I do love the design here. This is definitely very cool looking. Okay, melt adapter on down. Perfect. Let's see what we've got next. Wait, did it start locking up there that melt stuff down? Okay, that is pretty amazing. <laughs> That's awesome. That's very cool. Now that I think about it, how is it that, uh, how is it that, uh, the human torch doesn't burn all his partners after he touches them or walks up to them and stuff like that? All right. We are dealing with some dark giant situations. Oh, gosh. Here they come. Here they come. Gotta be careful. Nice and easy. Get away from here, jerk. Let's melt this down. Perfect. Let's see. What else do we have around here? Ooh. Okay, we have something to assemble. Let's see what this will be. I guess that's kind of like the engine part or something. Oh, the hammer will suffice in just a moment. Can blast this? Yes. Cool. Gotta love that. There we go. Double stars. That's fantastic. Here come the enemy rushing in. Blast them. Collect stars quickly while we have the multiplier on. Fantastic. Sorry, guys. I'm just going to pause this real quick. Sorry about that, guys. So, just so apparently I just looked out the window and there's probably a big fire somewhere not too far away because could see smoke up in the air, so there was like a lot of fire trucks go by. I've never seen that many fire trucks. That was crazy. So, uh, I hope uh, everything will be good there. That is crazy. But nonetheless, uh, I guess let's get back to the Lego Mamba. Go back to the Oh, look at that. I get to fly with the awesome <laughs> camera throwing ability. That is awesome. Gotta love that. Smashing him back. And Mr. Thor. Break all that stuff. Can I break that last piece? Yay! Some touch piece. Now, what about these? No, 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 the main part. There we go. Look at that. That's a great way of beating your stuff down very quickly for this level. There we go. And just a couple more things left over here to hit. Can I hit that too? There we go. My goodness, we're getting so many studs already. And I, I don't know how long this level is, but <laughs> we're already doing really well, that's for sure. Which is nice, because then that means I don't have to focus on stud collecting as we carry on. All right, so now I guess let's charge this up with our stud gun. Boom. Did it work? There we go. Now it works. Ooh. That was cool. Alrighty. Is something good happening or something bad happening? Okay. That looks good. Uh oh. Here we go, though. Whoa. What the heck? How the heck did all of you get in? So many of you have gotten over here. Man, we got to get our hands on Loki. Make him pay. Come on. The god of the thunder. All right. Getting plenty of studs. Now, before we carry on, I think I should destroy these things, too. That would be a good idea, right? There we go. Destroy all that stuff. Plenty 
have start being collected right here. And this is creating parking cars. All right. And let's just smash this these last two gears here. I mean, there's obviously more of them that we could be smashing. Oh, my goodness. I'm hearing more police. This time it's the police, I believe. Not a fire truck. It doesn't have that <laughs> noise. <laughs> the typical fire truck here in Canada makes. At least here in Ontario, Canada. Alrighty, so let's see. Can I smash this? I just really would love to get the step count done with and taken care of already. Oh my goodness. Sorry about that. Just a sec, guys. Alrighty, we are back at it. Goodness sakes, that progress for that guy is just really out of my hands. So, yay, sorry. I really am apologetic, though, about the fact that it happened. Obviously, if I had to choose, I would try to avoid having all these weird pauses every now and then, but then again, if somebody is in danger and they need help, obviously, the police and the fire trucks and all that needs to get there, and that's more important, so, yay. Keep that in mind, I guess. Alrighty? Alright, plenty of studs right here, and I'm also seeing a blue stud, which is going to increase our score nicely. Here we are. Whoa! Look at that! That is so beautiful. Man, they did a great job. So majestic looking. All right, let's go. Full ass on. Bam. All right, let's take these suckers down. For the guard. Wait, that sounded weird when I said it like that. I'm just going to leave it alone, though. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let that one fly. That just makes it so. Whoa, that almost fell down. It almost was that down, I got it. Boom! I love that slam down of that. Come on, take him down, boy! There we go. Little bit of studs there. Not too bad. Wait, no. Switch to this, fella. Here we are. Get rid of these walls. Of course, China is generous believer we're close we're so close already i mean there's really not a lot left but we are hoping obviously to do well all right take down the enemy five of them down and only five to go and there we are <laughs> oh shit oh that evil death god evil death you like what i've done with them right say that before. That's a little weird. I don't know. I just find that funny to imagine Loki saying, chill out, bro. Imagine if Loki was played by Arnold Schwarzenegger. Oh my god. Alright, that would have been hilarious. That would have been something, that's for sure. Can I not take this down? There we go. Alright, we've almost arrived at the gate. Stuff collected there, and the final enemy has been taken care of as well. Whoa, dude! What the heck? Behold, you are now under my power. Oh, yeah? Well, how about the fact that right now I'm hitting you with my shield for the height? Tough time for now? Yeah. Coward. Yeah, coward. over that because he's got electrical powers maybe no i guess not all righty uh well then let's switch to this yeah there we go my goodness when you have four characters it's so hard to get to the one that you want to choose there we go all right that will require some smashing we usually need hulk for that but i would imagine that thor could take care of that as well boom there we go 
Sterling and Reed actually. There you go. Mr. Hawkeye will be fielding next to this. Hey, there he is. Where have you going, though, my friend? All right, Hawkeye, do your thing, buddy. Let's get it done. Give it a nice pull. There we go. Oh, whoops. What the heck are you doing, Hawkeye? You're touching the wrong person. Hawkeye went eagle again, just like he did in the film. Come on, shake him down. There we go. Good stuff. All right, let's proceed, shall we? Oh, there they are again. Might as well go a red pull and rookie. And a lot. And I mean a lot of rockets. How did nobody notice that there was a gajillion rockets being built and assembled in the Empire State Building, for God's sake? I mean, really? Nobody detected that? Nobody was like, geez, what is this crazy signature and electrical bill that are coming through all of a sudden? Nobody bothered to check that out, right? All right. Wait. There we go. Touch through that. Perfect. And now we may proceed. Let's go, my friends. Take advantage of the multiplier. There we go. All right. So let's see. There's obviously a way to get up there with one of the characters. We could blow up this machinery with Hawkeye. That is definitely something that we want to get done. Come on, Torch. Let's do this together, my friend. Take down the enemy. Perfect. All right. Now we're going to assemble the rest of these walls here to allow one of our characters to scale across, either Hawkeye or Black Widow, for that matter. But first, let's collect some of these stars because we want Alice to keep up our true believer ranking. We've done a really good job of that so far. And oh, let's keep it going, shall we? Yeah, I love that scream from the Hulk. <laughs> so animalistic, so awesome sauce. Can I get that star? Oh, it's going to drop. There we go. Look at those guys. What's up, boys? How we all doing? Oh, yeah. Look at my combos. What the heck? That guy's gorgeous. How dare you, dude? I was your most dangerous enemy at that moment. And you chose to ignore me? By the way, Piper, you should maybe invest in smaller guns, because your guys have guns that are bigger than the actual person. Can I not pull this? Okay, I think this is only for Spidey, probably. Uh, probably, sorry. So, now we can proceed. Going this way. Now, of course, with this bit, you could have just climbed all this with uh, the human torch pretty easily. You could just fly up. Done. <laughs> That's all that there is to it. That's why it's nice to have superpowers. I bet you that's something that Hawkeye and Black Widow say a lot of times every time that they hang out with the Avengers. Oh, my. All right. Two deadly lasers this time. We got to get Black Widow over there. Drop like a steak or banana. <laughs> did you guys see that? Okay, for those of you that saw it, write in the comment section below. I did just that. I did with an exclamation mark, and that's it. All right. Just so I could know how many of these bits needed. All righty. So let's see. Here we are. Doing a little bit of uh, hacking, I guess would be the word. Getting some more blue stars because those are easy to pick up. Why the heck not? Well, it's definitely going to come in handy, especially when we are buying characters, red bricks, vehicles, a whole bunch of the unlockables, etc. Oh, God. Ooh, okay. Those are enemies that only Mr. Torch can take down because they are armored. Dude. Come on, dude. What the heck is going on here?
Facebook. So it's there, and uh, I guess we follow it. Let's do this. All right. I like how the Bruins pretend like the, their thing is to tell them. They're not over 9,000? Oh no, he's actually got a pretty good budget, right? So he just does not want to take advantage of it. All right, it looks like the team up is now for Cap and the human boss. Actually, a pretty interesting team. Let's save up real quick. There we go. That was a nice little slam down attack. Pretty cool. Alrighty, so let's see. I'm just kind of collecting these three studs because there's really not a lot of work to involved in doing this. I must admit, this is pretty god darn easy. Take down all that junk. There we go. Blasting some of this stuff all out of the way. Light the polish. Can I destroy that? Yay. Sauce box mode engaged. Now if I destroy this flag, that's going to be number two, right? Yeah. So I want to be careful, because I don't want to pick up the mini kits, like I said before. Because I'm trying to save that up for the 100% luck. All right. So there's a little bit here for Mr. Fantastic, who's unfortunately not way back. Oh, my goodness gracious. I should have gotten that flag by mistake. All righty. Here we go. Time to take on Risco. Whoops. Oh, I think I just need some block points. Done. There we go. Boom. Get in close. Couple of shots. Heel to the face. Heel to the head. Heel a lot of times to the head. And there goes Risco. It is on its own. That's good. I think your calculator is broken, Arn and Zola. Because I think it's the other way around. 95% of failure. No, sorry. The 100% of failure for you guys. Oh, gosh. Here we go. Of course, he's going to send in his minion barrage to try to stop us at this point. It's not going to happen, but whatever. There we go. A little shield placement. So hopefully that will deactivate that cannon. I'm just going to run around right here real quick. Get that. No, I think it's the other way around, my friend. I think it's the other way around. You're gonna get up there, like, fry you guys up. Whoa! <laughs> or, or not, or not. I get it, I get it. You guys don't want me to hang out with you. That's cool. Not really, but still. It's not nice, I must say. No! I don't want to be fried! Trying to get that blue stud, though. Or several blue studs, I should say. Okay, so let's see. Is there anything to show this machinery? It looks like it's somewhat important. I guess not. I guess it isn't really important. So let's see, what is this thing? Maybe this needs to be destroyed? It's got hydro logos on it. I would guess maybe it does. Maybe not, though. Bizarre. It's not breaking. I don't know. Do we need to deactivate another one of these? Or oh, look at Hawkeye and the Black Widow. I only now realize that that's them. What the heck is still shooting? Oh, okay. It's over on this side. How did I not realize that? There we go. Down for it. Let's 
using the default mode network, which can boost connectivity and help make things easier, retrieve memory, and become more self-connected. Unplug. Literally. When you are under a little bit of minus TV from time to time, if you aren't activating your brain as recently, please no doubt take more frequent detox for just 30 minutes a day. Try cutting all of your electronics away. This will help your brain actually have more time to process all the information you've been feeding it, and you'll feel a lot more peaceful afterwards. To release those feelings of overstimulation, consider doing yoga or something creative like drawing or playing music. Trust me, you'll thank yourself later. Get your breaks into your day. Now for the big question. When do you actually take that smart smoothie? Me time. It depends on how you want to do it. Some people like to treat us like a self-care appointment every day and work it in based on their schedule. Do you want to admit your bank of appointment with you? Well, taking care of your brain is just as important. Once you block off that me time on your planner, stick to it. However you decide to take rest time for yourself, the most important thing is to not neglect it. Time away from activities such as work or school is important for staying sharp and maintaining that first lifestyle we all strive for. Without it, we would burn out and face the consequences of stress and exhaustion. So next time you feel like you could use a break, take it. You've earned it.
says he's such a... I just wanted to try because I know that there would have been... Because there would have been someone saying, Oh, I can try to go get those stars. And I'd be like, Well, but I don't think I can get them right now with these shells and cat water. Yep, a bike of this house. I just can't care. That would be really good. I want someone like that to help me out. Assembling this thing, my dick. I was gonna say it's a puzzle, and I guess it is. Never mind, it's actually a mechanism for a guitar. What the heck? Okay, that's a nice computer screen, I guess. Alright, Black Widow, time for you to do a little bit of puzzling. Here we go. So, what do you have in your hand? How do these work? Okay, I think that just goes this way. Probably require access to the screen. I would imagine. Which means 
Black Widow, you're up. What am I doing? What the heck am I doing? Oh, okay. Is this? No. <coughs> Too happy. So don't do it. Can I fly with 
song on? Just barely, yeah. You just kind of hover. Because remember, if you remember the movie, the first film, yep, that armor did fly for like a minute and a half, and then it didn't fly. Alrighty, that is it, down to three. Bam! There we go. Alright, getting the multiplier here was really nice. Oh 
take advantage of the motorcycle. Take the motorcycle. The cops will get you. Most likely. Men are working in these from a shop where it's a mess door on. That's how they tease you. That's how, that's how they get you to come back around to folks. You'd be like, look, that, that was so fun. I want to try that. And then you realize that you do have to try it again, but you have to come back for it. All right, there we go. The activation has occurred. Double A, the big ones. The, two, the big ones. Points where we could toss the shield into. Let's see, let's grab some of these blue studs. Hopefully, that will get us very, very close. Okay, so now here we don't have a deflector beam yet, so I was, can't really do anything about that quite yet. So let's see, let's try this. Maybe this will work. We'll have the shield there. Is that going to do something? Okay. So it powers up the beam. Thank you. 
Nipsey needed dog food so bad she would have came over and got some dog food. She, she's a mess. <laughs> I'm looking, let me look. 